Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So better late than never, late last week in my part of the world, Microsoft finally rolled out the security fixes for Microsoft Edge. As part of the Chrome and Chromium security updates we received last week, so if you were using your Edge browser over the weekend, you will definitely have received the update by now, but just a quick video just to keep you guys posted and in the loop like we like to do on the channel. So after this latest update has been applied, version and build is sitting on 139.0.3405.102 and that's been bumped up from 0.86. Now a quick recap, if you did miss my other videos from last week, there were six security fixes. Thankfully, there were no zero days exploited in the wild last week that had to be patched or any critical vulnerabilities. And out of the six security fixes that rolled out, three of those were addressing high severity vulnerabilities listed as heap buffer overflow, race in V8 and out of bounds write in angle. So just double check your browsers up to date because it is your first line of defense. Now with all that out the way, something I did spot with this latest point release after it was installed is in regards to something I posted on a couple of weeks ago, where I said that Microsoft had come full circle with Edge's main menu being bloated again. And if we just head over to Canary, an early preview version, this is what I was referring to just to kind of do a quick recap. What happened is Microsoft had placed the new performance and secure network into the main menu. And as you can see, you can't fit everything on the screen. The main menu is bloated again. So if you are running a smaller screen, a device with a smaller screen, everything can't fit in like it used to. And Microsoft has, and as mentioned, Microsoft came full circle where a while back they debloated the menu and then it was full of bloat once again, causing the main menu not to fit. Now, just to let you know, if we head back to the stable, after this update, I've seen as you can see, things are looking much better and are improved where everything fits on the screen again. And I have noticed that if we head to more tools that Microsoft has moved performance, secure network and apps. So apps, performance, secure network have been moved out of this main menu into the more tools overflow menu. And I think that's a much better move in the right direction. So Hopefully this does stay like this because I have noticed it's only on my Windows 10 device, not yet on my Windows 11 device with this point release update. And in preview, we still have the bloated menu. So hopefully this does stick around because I think that's a much better layout. Everything just fits on the screen, especially if you are running a laptop as an example with a 14, 15, 16 inch screen, just to mention that example. So apps, performance, secure network have been moved out into the overflow menu. And I think that's definitely a move in the right direction. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.